Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Light Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I am here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Aquariuses who are watching. So if you have Aquarius as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So Aquarius, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart, Aquarius is your person. That's your person and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and officially begin and get started, please keep in mind that this is and will be a journal reading for your sign Aquarius. So it may or may not resonate for you here specifically. And if it does not, please don't take it personally. Also, Aquarius, if you are interested in viewing your extended reading, which will be the energy that foreshadows the energy of this reading, feel free to check out the Patreon membership. It'll be linked in the comments and in the description. But without further ado, Aquarius, let's see what we have when it comes to the energy of you and this person. All right, what do we need to know here for my Aquariuses when it comes to the energy of love? Who is this person? All right. We also have, I am warming up to your energy. We'll refer back to that if needed, but let's go ahead and stick with what we have so far. How does this person truly feel towards Aquarius? And what would they like for Aquarius to know? What are their next steps? Okay. So let's officially begin here. First we have, we are so similar, we get along effortlessly. I want love, but I'm used to being alone. Please don't get discouraged while trying to get to know me. I love you more than you know. I hope you see the potential in both of us, not just me. And... Butterflies can get scary too. It's overwhelming. Okay, so Aquarius, I feel like this is someone fairly new or perhaps someone making their way towards you here. And I feel like you don't want to psych yourself out of this connection by feeling like, oh, this is too good to be true. And maybe you don't feel like that at all. But regardless, Aquarius, you're deserving of good things. But I feel like things are going very well. And it's the type of person who is meant for you because they understand that you're not going to be exactly like them and that's okay. It's like opposites attract. There's still some similarities between you two, but say that extra message, I am warming up to you. Say that's your energy, Aquarius. This person knows that there's more beneath the surface, but even the surface level is intriguing. It's interesting. So I feel like this person wants to take their time getting to know you, Aquarius, and they're not about to make you feel bad or guilty. And I say that because we have, please don't get discouraged while trying to get to know me. This could be a shared energy or perhaps roles reversed, but say this is your energy, Aquarius, knowing that you need time to fully open up to people, but that doesn't mean that you won't slowly but surely open up along the way. The right people will know and just feel and have that idea and know what type of people that they want to attract. And it's like Aquarius is worth putting the, the time, the, the energy and the effort into getting to know them. So please don't get discouraged while trying to get to know me. This is something you don't have to plead towards this person or anyone else who is meant for you here. So I feel like this is your energy, Aquarius. And it's also like, Say you do need more time to open up to someone. I feel like the right person, it'll become an easier process or it won't feel so daunting or grueling or awkward if you feel that way. So that's our first energy. We have, we are so similar. We get along effortlessly. I feel like this connection comes naturally or just the bond, the rapport, the vibe that you two share with one another. 
It's like, say there's this show that you used to watch when you were growing up Aquarius. It was a random show and you just mention it and this person knows that show Aquarius is like the little things are understood. The bigger things are understood. Perhaps you two have shared beliefs, shared theories about things and it just makes it even more interesting. So we are so similar. We get along effortlessly. I feel like this also goes into like long term being able to click and mesh with this person long-term because of shared values here. We have, I hope you see the potential in both of us, not just me. So I feel like this is a shared energy. It could be your energy specifically Aquarius, but hoping that this person has the same shared intentions as you. I don't want to feel like we're making something out of this just for this to go away, just for you to stray away or just for someone to back out of this. So I hope you see the potential also just like putting in the effort in. I hope you're putting in the effort for us or, or for this and not and it not just being me. So we have that message as well. We have, I want love, but I'm used to being alone. I feel like this is your energy Aquarius, but wanting love from the right person because it could be easier to do things in pairs or as a team, but it can also be easier th to do things alone if you're not with the right person. So it's like, I do want love, but if it's going to disrupt my peace or my, if it's going to limit me, then no, I don't want it. So just wanting something true, something real, something that does take time to build towards you could be dealing with a Sagittarius placement. It does not have to be the case. We have butterflies can get scary too. It's overwhelming. If I am describing your side Aquarius and the rules aren't reversed, hopefully you could fill in the blanks here. But I do feel like this is your energy. And sometimes when you're so excited, it could be a lot to take in. Or it's like you're watching things unfold and it's happening in your way. And once again, it could be a lot to take in. So this connection could be scary or it gives you or it gives you anxiety, Aquarius. But we can't control the future. We can control in the present moment. So and that's really all that matters, the present moment, because it things can change moving forward. So just go with the flow, Aquarius. Like try not to overwhelm yourself and just know that nothing can get in the way of what is meant for you and we have i love you more than you know so although this connection may have not amounted to the feeling of love just yet perhaps you could replace love with interest and i i feel like this person is focused on you aquarius they're ha they have their eyes centered on you like 100 percent of their devoted attention let's go ahead and receive our last couple messages for my Aquarius is one more message here. All right, so let's take both of those messages that came out. Once again, if you do want to continue on with this reading after these messages, that extended reading will be found in the comments and in the description. We have, I have a lot of love to give, but I don't want to give it away freely. I want to discover who you are. I'll never find anyone better. I have love for you always. I'm sorry I don't devote enough time for you as much as I want to. I'm working on myself. And you're all I see. You're all I see. So as I was just talking about this energy, this person having their 100% devoted attention towards you, Aquarius, you're all I see. It's not worth looking outside of this connection or trying to pursue something more because it's not only the physical attraction, it's so much more Aquarius. It's the depth, it's the conversations, it's your mind Aquarius. There's so much to you. I want to discover who you are. Once again, there's so much to you Aquarius. There's layers and it's like... Um, I, I feel like there's a a saying that I could say or a phrase, but so much more behind like live uh, I'll I'll just 
related to um, someone like observing but also living behind their eyes of course and that's your mind and it's like there's so much going on in Aquarius's mind as far as what Aquarius thinks their thoughts their feelings their emotions their hobbies their interests like there's so much more to you there's layers there's pieces there's fractions like and this person wants to be consumed in it I'll never find anyone better I have love for you always that feeling when you know you know not wanting to jeopardize this, not wanting to lose this, this person, they're set on you, Aquarius. Then with your energy, we have, I'm sorry I don't devote enough time for you as much as I want to. I'm working on myself. So I'm going to tie this in with butterflies can get scary too. It's overwhelming. Perhaps you've kind of, and also I want love, but I'm used to being alone. I feel like for you, Aquarius, you do give this person your attention. They could be someone that you are interested in, but you're slowly but surely easing into it. If you're worried about perhaps codependency or what if I fall for this person and then it, it's not meant to be, then I, I feel like you still want to, because it, it, depending on who you are, it could be easy to get consumed by a feeling. And I feel like you don't want to fall into a temporary feeling until you know or feel like it's true. And perhaps time needs to take place here for that to happen and we have i have a lot of love to give but i don't want to give it away freely a concern of yours aquarius but i feel like if you start to question things if you start to feel confused something's off listen to your gut feeling um but if it feels right you'll you'll know some some new feelings are scary just keep that in mind aquarius but everything and even you Aquarius you have your limitations you know what's best so do what's best for you as far as signs we do have Virgo for Aquarius so you could be dealing with the Virgo Gemini Virgo Gemini last but not least is Scorpio and once again Aquarius your extended reading will be found in the description thank you all for watching that is all for today please like comment and subscribe and I will talk to you all next time bye